as Wunctious has started on this. Well, not a zombie piglin farm. This is actually going to be our, our lounge area. This is going to be kind of in the center of all the places that are points of interest on the server. So Naughty and the community cities are down there. Um, as, this is obviously um, as is. Uh, the stronghold's over there. The mansion's going to be over there, as well as my starter island. Uh, Tim and Seth haven't decided where they're going to live yet, but this is going to be the central. <laughs> Because of that, I kind of want to bring this up to a level, this, this these tunnels up to a level on par with what Az has planned for this. Um, don't mind these, apparently he had to fight several ghasts as they spawned in here. We are going to prevent that from happening in here, but I want to make, I want to build this tunnel. Um, and honestly, because this tunnel is to the Woodland Mansion, I'm just going to build a Woodland Mansion ha hallway. So let's get to it. Editorably inept here to, what, do you get it? Please get it. Get it? Editor? Adorably? Editorably? Editorably inept? Okay. Uh, I wanted to bring you a quick update before we jump into that time lapse of the mansion hallway. Um, as I did meet up with Az inside of his building of the Nether Lounge, and we had a little bit of an adventure. And from that adventure, an amazing piece of art was created. Um, I wanted to give a quick shout out to XML Cam for creating this piece of art that's showing on screen right now. Um, you're going to see a little bit of it, and you're going to be able to see a little bit of why this <laughs> piece of art came into existence. So we're gonna do that and then we will jump into the time lapse of the mansion hallway build. The mansion hallway build. Like the texture between the netherrack and the moss. It's like kinda of makes sense. I don't know why. It looks really because good. Like you you building this, I mean other than your little gas farm you got going on here. <laughs> um <laughs> I love the fact got, that like there's a I little got, lounge area got, that we can all branch and off. And I of. got guest here. Yeah, yeah me, Seth, and Az live down in that. Wait, me, Seth, and Tim live down in that hole. But I don't know where yeah. I don't know where Seth or Az are gonna move. I'm gonna probably Seth, still. Tim, Tim, you keep saying the wrong name. Tim. Yeah, I'm sorry. Repeat after, <laughs> oh, repeat after you. Okay. Also, I'm, do you I'm, have, do you have I, food? I'm in class. I got some. I can give you all I have because I'm headed I, home. No, I, I, I just need like one or two pieces because like I, I'm like low because I bought the gas like face <laughs> in. Because you built a gas farm. You know, would it be helpful if I like wrote a or made a channel in Discord that made a channel in Discord that uh, essentially would allow you to like write down the projects that you have and like maybe percent completion or something like that? Uh, I, I, I don't think it's necessary. I mean, it's, uh, it's nice to have. It would be nice, because then like everyone knows yeah, it, what it, everyone else is working on and can show off yeah. things. They're mad at me. You got it. I have to avoid them. I'm not I'm not getting oh, in a fight oh, with it. Wait, are they mad at me? Nope, they're not mad at me. Yep, they are mad at me. Nope, yep, yep, bye. Go, go, go. I'll go, be back go, in go, a few. Right, No, they still hate you. Run. I know, I'm just gonna kill them Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> move! Move! <laughs> move! <laughs> other side! Not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I am not a piglet. Nice! They're all lining up nice and tight for this arrow fest. What is it with you and creating, farm. like, manual farm? <laughs> I was just making the gold what? farm I was just gonna make a gold farm joke. I, I keep making manual farms, right? <laughs> yeah. Yep. Oh, you're not mad at also, me. Also, what that gas here for? Uh, here's the... It's for summoning the dragon again. There's some rockets. I just need, I just, I, I just need one. I, just need one. I literally bought uh, them from you, so... <laughs> I, just, I just need one. My, no, you're good. Take the, take the rockets that you need. I have a supplier. What's a mouse? Moss. Moss. Like the, oh, crap. Oh, moss. I have seven. <laughs> that'll be... That'll work. I don't think I have any moss right now. He's already out of range, isn't he? Yeah. No, 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 no. This is not what I wanted. Mm 
Nice. Uh, I wish I had blocks for this. There's just this is serious gold farm ter oh this is not good. This is serious gold farm territory. Oh, this is actually not a bad place for a gold farm as well. Just thinking about it right now, getting some like gold here, going up to the nether roof and getting some gold. Not a bad idea. Let me seriously block this off as soon as I can. Keep coming through there. Okay. We should be back to a safe nether tunnel. <laughs> Time lapse we are completed with the woodland mansion nether tunnel it is i had i'm not gonna lie i had to go back to the woodland mansion and like check measurements like 17 times um and also placing those little logs right there right behind me not fun not fun let me show you the other side of this real quick uh the the to give you an idea of where it's at uh the Woodland Mansion nether portals right here, and then if you go through it, it's a little cheaty, it looks a little crap. That, I'm fine with this for right now. Um, I can come back, and I haven't finished, I just don't wanna see outside. I haven't finished my nether tunnel, so to my starter island. So this is gonna be what this is for right now. Um, so it's a little cheaty, it's a little just put blocks down and make sure nobody can see, but you can barely see it through the nether portal. I also want to make this a little bit bigger so it kind of covers this entire wall uh, but I don't have the obsidian for it. I haven't really been obsidian mining but I need to go to the end and do that. Either way I wanted to show you kind of what it looks like on the outside having to place those those cursed blocks. Who does that? Who has it facing inwards? I just will never understand that but that's what the that's what the woodland mansion is and there's a guest. So this is kind of what it looks like from the outside. Um, that right there is when I got blown off of the platform that I was building by a ghast. Um, but yeah, I love it. I love how it like, I know that it's not like original as far as like the design goes, but as I was doing it, I was thinking about some things that I can do to make this a little bit more unique. I wanted to keep it right now just like you're walking down a tunnel. Just like you're walking down a, um, not a tunnel, sorry. Just like you're walking down a inside of the Woodland Mansion. So you really get no feeling of being in the nether just by entering the portal. It looks like you just came back out into the Woodland Mansion. So I like that for right now, but I do want to do something with this. What I want to do is I want to turn the nether into the Woodland Mansion. Which means, no, 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 no. That came out very wrong. I do not want to go around the entire nether and rebuild this. 
what I want to do is I want to start bringing in like tendrils of the nether reaching into the woodland mansion here so it's gonna this 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 tunnel is definitely going to evolve but it's gonna be more free form um, for right now though I am happy with this this looks amazing um, probably need to match this up a little bit better with the nether lounge but um, the fact that you can walk from here turn around and there's piglins and nether everywhere I love this feeling love the feeling so we are done for right now and let's move on to our next project on the topic of infrastructure planning building cut 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 on the topic of infrastructure building and getting things ready for eh, just the nimbuses one thing that we haven't done yet um, that we've kind of talked about probably off camera <laughs> I don't I don't know if I included that clip unfortunately I'm sorry but um, bad joke jars you see a lot of the nimbuses here like to make bad jokes uh, I am no I'm not innocent I'm not innocent in this I make a ton of bad jokes and like that's all well and good until the bad jokes just go too far so what we're going to do is we're going to introduce a jar and that jar is going to be right here right by the right by the nimbus mansion um and we are going to set it up so that whenever a nimbus makes a bad joke they have to put something in the jar could be anything it could be anything we're not like not not diamonds doesn't have to be diamonds could be diamonds could be netherite Ooh, could be netherite Ooh. no one wins this jar though How, this jar is just going to be here for I don't know as many bad jokes that are in the season that's what's going to be collected in here in the jar so let's get to it Hello, this is there's seriously a zombie. It's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> By right behind me, I mean right in front of me. Hello, this is the jar. The jar, again, is to make sure that any nimbuses that make a bad joke uh, have to throw an item, any item, could be any item, into the jar and essentially just lose a random item. So because i have made enough bad jokes i feel like i need to be the first one to do this so we're going to die real quick while we wait for just to get fireworks on why do you have an egg why are there so many eggs um yeah we're going to go up there and we're going to go ahead and put a put a i'm not i'm not good at this game all right we are going to go ahead and put a item in the jar and all you gotta do is pull the top off and let's see we'll put our chicken there there you go there you go that's is that a baby wearing armor there we go we have now paid for our consistent bad jokes um we paid dearly for it with two chicken heads there's so many chickens in this place i'm pretty sure it's sephiris who's breeding them no it's not actually we just ate sephiris's room Anyways, we went ahead and put some stuff in the jar, and now we have to avoid getting killed by a tiny baby zombie wearing golden armor, which is not always fun. I don't care how geared out I am, I'm scared of babies. Do you want to see a little trick? This is a little trick that I learned uh, a while ago, uh, but zombies don't pathfind over to here. They, they can't, zombies are in any mob really, is not allowed in this mansion. They come, they try, and they get stopped right there. Now, it may look like it's just magic, or there's some server commands, or some weird thing that's going on, or not vanilla Minecraft, but it is, I swear. It's vanilla Minecraft, and I'm about to show you how to do it. If you go ahead and take carpet, like any color carpet works, it doesn't really matter, but if you take carpet, and you plant sweetberry bushes below it, 
mobs don't naturally pathfind into sweetberry bushes. So if they were to come over here and like try and get across this little block right here, they would get essentially stuck in the sweetberry bushes, which they would if there was not carpet there. As soon as you put carpet there, that allows you to walk out. That allows you to walk in or sorry, out and then in without stopping, without worrying about like any buttons or any any anything around here you can just walk in walk out um, so it creates an invisible barrier that no mobs can cross now it's not foolproof if you were to test this with a ton of mobs they can get pushed onto the carpet and then they will pathfind to you but any mobs like this like the majority of mobs that you're going to find they're not going to walk in you can use this for creepers you can use it for skeletons they will shoot you still you can use it for baby zombies and it essentially creates a nice looking invisible barrier for the entrance to your base. Thank you for the review, baby zombie. There's something I've wanted to do for a little while, but haven't really done in Minecraft ever. Um, and that is that is uh, just simply to get revenge. These bastions probably account for more of my deaths in Minecraft than all other sources combined. So we're going to tear it to the ground and get ready for the time lapse of that. So I have no idea what I did, but literally every piglin in the world on the server right now is mad at me. Except this one. Are you mad at me? No idea what is going on here, but they are very mad at me. Seriously, I didn't do anything. I didn't. I didn't do it. Whatever you think I did, I didn't do it. Anyways, this is the progress that we made. No. Oh, seriously. Really, really, really. That's not what I. Really, I can't even dodge it. Oh, and over here is going to be more of a problem. Yeah, yeah, come on up. Hello, my piglins. Uh, every, everything and its mother um, is kind of mad at me right now, and I'm not 100% sure why, but we're going to take our toys, and we're going to go home as soon as we get shot by this owl. We're going to go home. Come, don't hit me! I didn't even kill anything. I didn't do anything. I'm innocent here. I didn't do it. Nope, that's a bad way to go. That is a very bad way to go. And there's skeletons here. All right, well, let's just get back to... Let, we got our stuff. Let's get back to home. <laughs> home. It sounds so good. It sounds so far away. Are you are you mad at me now? Like is literally every piglin on the zombie piglin on the server mad at me? No. All right. Well, with my luck, there'd be a gasp on there. <laughs> 